Yeah, this is my basically my year anniversary. So I'm back out on the slopes learning how to mono ski. You know, I just think back to when I was learning how to snowboard and you take your falls and that's part of the dues that you pay to learn some foundational skills so that you can progress. I love a good challenge. I think if you're not being challenged, then you should probably find something else to do. High fives! Woo! There's a learning process that needs to take place. Building those foundational skills requires patience. Once you get over those humps and things start to click, it really becomes super enjoyable. You feel like you know, you're making progress, and progress always motivates people to continue. Allison's an athlete too. She's, she's incredible and she's, I mean, it's, she's really close to my heart because I know, I know where she's at in life and, and the struggle that she's dealing with and she's got such a good attitude. It's, it's, it's been amazing to watch. You see Elena who's won medals at Sochi and she's here like giving me tips and encouraging me and you know pointing out specific things that I'm doing well and giving suggestions about things that I can do and Riding with people who are better than you always makes you better. That challenge and that encouragement has just been amazing. It's so important for us to give back. Like now that I've been in that mono skiing game now for 16 years, it's an honor and a privilege to give back and to watch these athletes grow and, and make these huge strides. And I think it's really a responsibility of ours to to make it happen and help people know that their lives are gonna be enjoyable again. And that's kind of the biggest thing. Not only can you get back out on the hill, but you can really enjoy what we're doing. And um, the High Fives Foundation puts that all together. Definitely shout out to the High Fives. Shout out to all the Paralympians who were here who helped us out. You know, the crew from Craig that came and rode and you know, even my friends from San Diego who just flew out just to see me back on the mountain for the first day. Like, this trip has been epic.